everyone! I hope you guys are all doing well and I hope the new year started well for you. I finally got the chance to film, yay! <laughs> I have a huge Chanel haul for you. And here's my bag. So they gave out this Chanel bag for the holidays. I got lots of amazing stuff. <laughs> so the first thing that I bought was the Lotion Confort. Um, this is a silky soothing toner. I had bought this last year in summer and I kept buying it after that because I found it to be very good. This is alcohol free and it does um, get off the traces of makeup that are left behind and I have really dry skin so I have to watch the products that I put on my face. I have to try to avoid products with alcohol as much as possible. It's not always unavoidable but I try to do it. And this is the one I'm currently using. You can see I used a big chunk out of it. <laughs> and this is my backup. I also uh, use the Guerlain which I showed in my other video. So these are my two go-to toners. I really love them. This is what it looks like um, from up close and it really does prep your skin for the next stage in your skincare routine so I highly recommend this one. I will be doing a skincare video um, sometime in the future but um, this is just a haul video. <laughs> so the next thing I bought was their um, Gentle Biphase Makeup Remover. Uh, this is really gentle on the eyes. Um, if you have sensitive dry skin like I do, you're probably gonna like this. I do like the one from Dior. I really love it. I rave about them all the time. But I do love the Chanel as well. It gets off the toughest waterproof mascaras. This is also a backup for me. You can know when I love something, I tend to have a backup. So if you notice, you see there are two liquids here, a clear one and a light blue. And when you shake it up, it becomes one and you get off your mascaras very easily with this one. This is the one that I'm currently using. I have like maybe a little more than a quarter of the product left in this one. So this is my backup. So really love that. This is the Hydromax Plus Active. This is a hydration mask and I can't say it enough. I really do have dry skin. So I wanna try out this to see how it works. I haven't tried it before, so I can't tell you much about it. But if there's anyone out there that tried it before, you can just leave your comment and let me know what you think. <laughs> So I can't wait to try this out. I am for any product that hydrates my skin. So I did buy um, the Body Excellence Hand Cream. I showed this in also another video of mine and I really, really love it. It has plant extracts in it as well. The Body Excellence Hand Cream absorbs very quickly into the skin, which is what I really like. I don't like products that leave um, traces or oily film behind so i'm really loving this product it's a bit pricey but for my skin there is no price <laughs> did i just say that <laughs> okay the part that everybody loves is did she buy any custom um, makeup i did the next thing i bought was their rouge coco lune russe and I really love this lipstick. It is a beautiful color. This is the packaging, really cute. Before I apply my Rouge Coco lipstick because I find it to be not as moisturizing as the YSL Rouge Volupt, um, I always dab a little bit of lip balm on my lips before I put this on so to prepare it. And this is a really beautiful color. You can see it here. It's a dark red. Absolutely gorgeous. <laughs> yeah. So, loving the Rouge Coco. I have the nicest girl at my Chanel counter. I 
kind of mentioned to her last year in summer that I had loved, loved, loved the lip glosses that they have and I've used this one up pretty much and she said I can't make you any promises but I can try to get it for you and I'm like really it was a limited edition and it was last summer what are the possibilities that I'll get it and she's like okay I'll try but don't get your hopes up one week later she called me and I end up getting two of them isn't that awesome? I had to give her like a huge box of chocolate because I really love the formula. This is laser. This is the number 407. And she got that for me. And I was really, really excited about it. So she got me two. Beautiful color. The formula does not let my lips peel. My lips doesn't peel. It's showing through the color. And what it is, it's it's a gloss it's really really sheer you don't see any color in this whatsoever when you put it on because I am wearing it at the moment and you can't see it it's just pure gloss but I really love the formula and I'm so excited she really made my day with that set. <laughs> so loving that okay now here's the little bag the little bag what's in it let's here we go I bought five nail polishes. I haven't bought any from the new collection as yet because it's not available at my Chanel counter just yet. But if I do buy something, I'll let you know about it. And the first one that I bought was Rose Confidential. Uh, this is the number 491. And it is a beautiful pink color. This is what it looks like. With the CC's on top. Typical Chanel. <laughs> but I really love this color. Beautiful pink. So excited about that. The famous Paradoxal in 509. This is a beautiful purple color. This is a must have and I highly recommend it. So cute! <laughs> So, so cute. The next one is Gondola. This is uh, 499 or 499, however you say it. And this is a beautiful color also with um, gold sparkles in it, which I really like. So pretty. It's very dark and beautiful. Jade Rose. This is a color that doesn't get talked about a lot on YouTube and I find that this is such a beautiful light pink. If you're in a professional arena you're gonna love this. Beautiful and it's almost neutral. Well at least on me it almost looks neutral and I love that. What I love about the Chanel nail polishes is that they're very shiny and beautiful and they are long lasting. I get three to four days of wear out of them depending on if I use um, a really good top coat. So beautiful color, Jade Rose, so pretty. 493. And the last one that I bought was Rouge Fatal. I love this color. This is the number 487. And this one could easily become my favorite red, but I do like another red better from OPI. But it's so beautiful. This is just a red color to have. It's like very old Hollywood kind of uh, color. So pretty, very understated. Oh, love this color. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching and for all your support. Until next time, bye guys. Mwah. <laughs>